How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. Hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. So even though we are right off the heels of my Black Thor video, which I released just a few days ago where I got black colors for Thor, that was amazing. And I'm very happy that I have Thor completed because look at those skins in the black colors, they look amazing. But I'm trying to get every single legend to black colors, as you guys know. And I finally completed the next legend, who was actually right behind Thor in terms of experience. So that's why it didn't take me that long after getting Thor to get him. And that is Zul. I got level 25 Zul, guys. That is right. Ooh, so I can finally get black colors for Zul. It feels like I should have had him a long time ago, just because I've been playing Zul for so long. I mean, Thor came out way later, way later than Zul, and yet now I'm just finally getting black colors for Zul, so I feel bad, not not even talking about you, Sidra, you're only level 19, but <laughs> you came out before Zul. <laughs> we'll get Sidra to black too, guys, don't worry. But today is a special episode because we're going to be playing with Black Thor for the first time ever. First things first, we got to go to the store and actually buy the colors. There they are. And I have 100,000 gold in the bank, so we can afford the 25,000 price. Classic, timeless, legendary! <laughs> there it is, guys. There it is. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right, before we go on, let's count how many legends do I have with black colors. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45 black colors, baby. 45. And there's only 50 legends, so there's only 5 legends left in the game. That I don't have black colors for. Those are Sidra, um, Rayman, Sidra, Rayman, Dusk, Onyx, Jayun. That's it. Onyx, Jayun, Sidra, Dusk, and Rayman. That's it. So, anyways, today we are going to use Black Zol for the first time ever. Before we do, Let's take a look at all of his skins with black colors, because I'm pretty sure I have every Zul skin. Oops, what did I just do? I hit random all on accident. There we go. So this is Arctic Trapper Zul. We got Demon Ogre Zul. Regular Zul. Amethyst. Amethyst. Look at the shading on that. Axe. We got Football Zul. Zul. <laughs> we got Iron Armor Zul. <laughs> And uh, that's about it. Those are the only Zul uh, skins. I will say that the weapons, a lot of them look way cooler if you change the weapons. Like, for example, if we put on, like, one of these other weapons, they look really cool. So Different weapons look better with, with red red colors. So that much is, is for sure. Uh, let's see. What's a good weapon that looks cool with black colors? Mm, how about this one? Oh, yeah. All right. So, first things first, we're going to play 10 strength Zul every single match, obviously. If you're not doing 10 strength Zul, are you even playing Zul? Alright, first match is against a Jayun Diamond, me and my Katars. Where are your Katars, sir? All I see is a great sword and a sword. Wait, is he black colors too? Oh my gosh. Alright, black Jayun versus black Zul. Don't ask me why I threw the axe away. I have no idea. Oh, hit him with that full charge. Ooh, the neutral sig comes out faster than most people expect. 
Right now, cannon is really popular because everybody thinks it's the golden weapon of choice. Personally, I don't know. I think it's pretty good, but I don't know if it's the best weapon out there. Definitely not one of the worst, though. You gotta be real careful with Jay un boys. He kill you in one light attack combo. See there? I should have probably done something else, but I was hoping he'd jump into that. We can't. We can't hope a diamond jumps into an attack, guys. Diamonds just don't do it. Okay, big boy. That one went right through you somehow. Ten strength, Jayun. Yeah, you might have a big weapon, but do you have big muscles? I'm so used to playing Jayun myself. I'm getting kind of messed up here, thinking that I'm I'm him. <laughs> do you guys ever do that? You all of a sudden think you're the other character? Oh my gosh. How my attacks be going through this guy though? Close. Oh my my, no no, not again, get that out of here. Neutral sig again, bro, you gotta watch out for that neutral sig. GG dude, GG. Where are your guitars? I don't see them, I'm confused man, I'm so confused. GG dude, GG, alright. We're gonna do, which skin should we do next? This one looks really scary. Uh, let's do Amethyst, man. Zul's only epic crossover skin. Again, we're going 10 strength. And uh, Amethyst is also unique because her signatures look a little bit different, see? I also really, really like her whip sound. It's, it's, it's literally a good whip sound. The only thing is her neutral sig on the axe, it really doesn't make that much of a sound. It's almost like a silent little whisper. In reality, you're hitting them as hard as a as like a tank. You know, like shooting their tank missile right at you. That's what it, you know, I would expect the neutral sig to have a little bit more of a, uh, of a sound, that's all. Nice! Dang, he just stopped my neutral, uh, my side sig short completely. I can't play lazy again. Gotcha! Very close, dude. Very close. He almost made it back. The cool thing about cannon is that, like, with the side airs and whatnot, it's really easy to get back sometimes. The neutral sig. Oh my goodness. Absolutely destroyed him. I don't even think I got touched. Ooh, 
Love that axe whip sound. GG. GG, dude. Whoop. 10 strength. Zol in the end was too strong. I gotta say, though, his. Isaiah did really good on his first stock. That was a good match on his first stock. All right, which uh, which which skin should we use? I think I'm going to go Gridiron Zol this time. Football Zol. Man, the athlete. Let's go football. I actually really do like watching uh, American football. I know half of my audience is European, but American football is really fun to watch. I got into it when I was like a teenager, and I've always liked it ever since. Going against Frider, Yumiko? Ooh, I don't know why, but I'm, I'm more scared of a Yumiko than I am of the other guys I just fought. Yumiko is really good. Oh. Oh. I can already see this is gonna be a struggle with with the cannon, so I might have to switch to axe and never look back, baby. Oh my goodness. He had the advantage on me and he just kind of gave it up. Alright, you know what? We can do it with cannon. We can do it with cannon. Okay, okay, that was that was good. I can't believe I survived. Okay, I finally died. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> he got to do push-ups because he's not nearly as strong as me. You know? He, he needs to work out. Little, little spaghetti arm Yumiko over here. Come here, boy. Dude, you just gotta scare them a little bit, make a move, boom, they're dead. Okay, I probably shouldn't have thrown my weapon. Probably should not have thrown my weapon. Yeah, this one's gonna hurt. But as long as I can do a little bit of damage, I'm okay. Okay, that's all right. She's in yellow. We got it. As soon as I threw my weapon, she put on the pressure. Boy, Yumiko. Ooh, 
that 10 strength comes in handy, don't it, little girl? I'm just kidding. I'm not calling her a girl because she's weak. I'm calling her a girl because she is a girl. And she's little compared to Zul. Okay? Okay? Definitely crushed that dude with the side air from across the map. That's where, that is where the 10 strength comes in handy. Alright, uh, let's see. Let's go Commander Zul. This is going to be the last match I do. Even if it's not all of the Zul skins. Might be a little bit of a shorter episode, but that's as much time as I got to record today, unfortunately. Alright, last match. Going against Peace Control J. Platinum Ada. Ooh, Ada's only got 4 defense versus 10 strength, guys. Ooh, Ada might be getting destroyed. We'll see. She's got to do a lot more hits to me than I got to do to her. Goodbye. See, she was trading blows with me pretty much, but look who died first. You can't just trade blows with Zul. You gotta, you gotta up that game. This might be a fast match after all. Oh man, her range got me somehow, dude. I didn't think she could range that. Oh, I did a spot dodge, man. She could have punished so hard. I shouldn't have done that spot dodge. Oh my goodness, the down sig on the spear! Such a good move because it hits stacked and it hits both sides. No reverse restock here, boys. Nope. Oh, that's game. GG, dude. GG. Nice comeback, though. Nice comeback. Alright, guys. Well, that's going to be it for this episode of Black Colors. Zol celebrating the Black Colors. I think that, uh... Let's see. Who's my next legend going to be? She's 19. Rayman is 21. Dusk is 23. So, Dusk might be the next one, guys. Onyx and... Zayat, yeah. Dusk is probably going to be the next one, but we'll see. We'll see. Anyways, hope you enjoyed, guys. Please drop a like if you did. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. And as always, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video, guys. Take it easy.